subscribe our channel for daily technology and smartphone videos hello friends welcome to my youtube channel and in today's video i will be quickly showing you samsung galaxy s9 plus new ot update so as you can see why i have just received a new ot update on my galaxy s9 plus which is a 317 mb of size and the change log says that uh, there is an improvement in the call quality and there is an improvement in the wallpaper area and some few bug fixes so i will be quickly showing you how to install it and what are the changes uh, in this particular update so without any further delay let's get started so guys as you can see this is a new software update for samsung galaxy s9 plus and uh, which says that uh, the call stability has been improved but uh, i never face any issues with the call stability and the quality of wallpaper has been improved so i don't know what it means by quality of wallpaper because it has already a great wallpaper and theme section and the all the wallpapers are very good so maybe there is some improvement with this wallpaper or something like that but apart from this there is no new changes observed in this particular ot update and uh, we will quickly install this ot update i will show you how to install it the rest of the change log says that the device stability and improvement and the bug fixes and everything so i don't know what are the bug fixes involved in this particular ot update so let's start with the install now option and it will prepare to update so it will take around 5 uh, to 7 minutes to complete the upgrade process so we will come back when this process is completed so update has been completed and let's see if there is any change in security patch level let me go to about phone uh software information and android security patch level is march 2018 you guys you can see and the build number has been changed the baseband version has been changed so let's try to wipe the cache data i will show you how to wipe cache data so as you can see the software update pop up has been come the, the device has been updated let's see okay let me turn off this phone and i will show you how to wipe cache in the samsung galaxy s9 or note 8 so to reboot this in the recovery mode you will need to choose power button volume up and bixby and need to press it at the same time let's see if it's booted or not so as you can see it's a recovery mode and let's go to wipe cache partition so as you can see it's wipe cache partition let's press power button yes so it will wipe down all the cache as you can see cache wipe has been completed and reboot system now so it's a very easy way to reboot your phone into the recovery mode to wipe the cache partition and now it will be reboot in the normal mode so let me add the password over here generally samsung phone took very long time to reboot or maybe to install any update i don't know why in spite of such a fast processor they are lagging in the reboot or in the install process so that's it everything is done and we are back now to the normal mode so guys that's it for today's video and i hope you like this particular video so guys uh, that's it for now and i hope you like this video if you like this video please hit like and subscribe to our channel we will see in the next upcoming video with more such type of video till then thank you very much and see you soon